do you do when people in the audience don't like you? Well, the answer to that question can be found in our next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom. I'm here in Las Vegas working an event called Stage Time Live. Stage Time University is a group that I'm associated with. I'm one of the coaches. Every year I MC their three-day event. One of our members came up to me earlier in the day and said, you know, when I first saw you online doing the weekly coaching, I didn't like you. I thought he was kidding for a moment, but then he said, I'm serious. I didn't really like you. It took me aback. But then when I thought about it, and I told him this, I said, I really appreciate you being honest. He said, I'm not sure what it was about you. I don't know, maybe I was having a bad day, the way your hair was parted, I don't know. I just didn't like you at first, but after a while you grew on me. And I really appreciate what you do now on the weekly calls and the advice you give, the coaching you do. His comments were a reminder to me that in every audience, there's somebody who's not going to like you. It, it's a first impression. You may remind them of someone else they didn't, that they didn't like earlier in life. I don't know what it is. We can't control them. All you can do is be yourself. Uh, this gentleman in subsequent weeks has seen me and he's gotten to learn my style and like me. You don't always have that opportunity as a speaker. You're only with people for an hour, maybe even less. Don't get caught up in who likes you and who doesn't. What eventually won the day with this particular gentleman is I was myself. He got used to my style and learned to appreciate what I bring to the group. My point with this video is this. Don't get caught up in who likes me, who doesn't. You can't control that. Be yourself and you'll connect with most people in the audience.